why have you lived such a charmed life? Because I think you have too, and I've followed yeah, your have, life. Yeah, I have, and I'm worried this is going to crash in no, on me. No, no, don't Any say day, that. the whole the whole sky is going to fall on me. <laughs> <laughs> like Al Bundy. <laughs> the Al Bundy experience. That's... <laughs> It's because you touch so many people that the karma, the good karma, comes back. That's what it is. Sounds too serious. <laughs> no, I'm serious. <laughs> That's what I just said. It sounds too serious to me. It's, it's because of what you've done for everybody else. Can you tell me about women who inspire you? Uh, you've already, you know them all. Signe, Grace, Diana, Darby, Kathy, who else? Nora. She was the very special to me. You always are the guy, you know, behind the scenes pushing everything, but it's always a strong woman in the front. Yes. Is that something, an idea you had? Or, is that what you did? I learned that from the Weavers. Ronnie Gilbert? Mm -hmm, yeah. A woman in the Weavers it was extraordinary. Okay, they represented the anti-war movement back in the day. They represented the counterculture experiment back in those days. Do they still represent those things today? As far as I'm concerned, yeah. But Tel Aviv was quite energetic. Did you get around? Did you make the? Did you go to Dizenkoff Street? I didn't go to anything. I just I hung out on the beach. That, and then I went back to my home hotel room and smoked some dope. Checking out the honeys and the, the hash. Beach. Oh, the honeys were beautiful. Uh, but yeah, I like Tel Aviv. I did I make it to Jerusalem, I but I didn't do any of that religious shit, so it didn't matter. And the new Pope, fuck him. He's same old shit. Same old shit, yeah. Uh, they're, 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 their outfits irritate me. They wear all this silly shit. Yeah, please. God damn, what a bunch of idiots. Hey, uh, Aaron. Yeah?